Vets for Vets kind of stemmed, um, it was an idea actually from Captain Terry Vaughn, who is an Army veterinarian that graduated from state, and uh, she came to me with the idea because she knew I was affiliated with a um, charity back home that works with active duty um, military working dogs and their handlers. And so she was kind of like, you know, I have these two dogs out of Columbus um, that have been retired due to severe degenerative joint disease, and I think they would really benefit from the rehab program here at State. Um, so she introduced me to um, Carl and Dustin, who are both out of uh, Columbus Air Force Base, and their dogs, Macy and Iva. And um, we kind of decided to take it on as our class project. And so the name Vets for Vets came up, and um, here we are. And Macy and I are about uh, four weeks into their treatment programs now. We chose to work with military working dogs to reward them for their service and to help them with any kind of service-related injuries they may have sustained, uh, either stateside or in combat. Um, I'm a veteran. There's another veteran in my class, and we chose to combine our passion for animal care and veterinary medicine with our service and by helping out the, uh, the military working dogs. So the Vets for Vets program has been underway for about 12 weeks now. We, we initially started the program with two service dogs and we see uh, the program really rolling out to a much larger platform. The, the vet school can, can provide physical therapy to up to 20 dogs every single day and so as many of those positions that we can fill as we grow the program um, the better and, and so we see the opportunity to grow as being quite significant and something that we look forward to participating in.